he says. Right the hills, he says. <laughs> somewhere. So we're here White Cliffs of Dover, also now known as the White Cliffs of Hell, because what you see behind you seems very deceptive. I'm sitting down because I am shattered after two miles on the White Cliffs of Dover. I was at one point, I think we were on our heels only, coming down the hill. Um, I'm not sure if I even filmed that bit to be honest, I might have been too terrified. <laughs> Here with Colin, and he's decided to take the day off with me to do crazy stuff. Um, we're riding from Dover to I don't know. See if I would get, but Margate's the plan. We'll see. We got we'll to, yeah, Captain Digby's. Um, hopefully, it's a lot less hilly than this. Um, but it is spectacular to be honest, um, the, the scenery and the weather is, is brilliant, so yeah, let's keep going in what's I'll call the breath back. <laughs> Hi guys, so um, we're only about I know, three, four miles. It's been quite a gnarly start to uh, to the day, but as you can see, the view is spectacular. We stopped off as a Dover uh, lighthouse, or the lighthouse up at the top of um, the Dover Hills. It's flattened out a bit now. We've just taken the drones up because the wind's pretty good, um, and it's been it's been quite amazing. Even though we're only gone like three odd miles the views and I'm being cautious next to the cliffs are obviously spectacular um, can't really beat this for, for a, a day off uh, to be honest um, it's quite amazing but um, and Co Colin's living life dangerously he's like right next to the cliff like because you know why why wouldn't you <laughs> he's got he's, he's more balls than I am um, I've, I've just, I've, I've had tumbles already this morning just because it's been so gnarly getting up the Dover Hills. Um, I think we're going to try an easier route along the road on the way home um, and hopefully it'll flatten out on the way. The plan is to go all the way along to Margate but we'll see how we go. It's, it's, uh, it's been pretty slow going already but hopefully it'll flatten out and we can uh, make a bit of uh, distance up now. But yeah, stay with it. It's like, do you own the heaviest unicycle known to man? Yes. Don't go up these stairs. <laughs> So we've made it to Deal, which um, I think, according to my Sherman's about 10 miles, maybe 12, I don't know anymore. Um, paths as well, lots of paths, it's great. It's really nice, to be fair. Nice little seaside beach on the side. Or do you reckon it's, it's one? Do you reckon we're following one? <laughs>
guys, so we're in Ramsgate, and as you can see, we're at the harbour, about 24, 25 miles, something like that. Um, it's been absolutely spectacular, to be honest. So we're going to get up to the highest point in Ramsgate, around the corner, I think, and then um, we'll look about what the journey holds on the way home. Hi guys, so made it 50 miles from Dover to Ramsgate and back uh, through some absolutely stunning locations. Um, White Cliffs of Dover, uh, Ramsgate was really nice, Deal, um, it's another little kind of town and all the villages that we've gone through in between. We've done uh, a bit of road on the way back. I didn't film just because it's uh, it was a little bit treacherous. So I want to make sure that, you know, we kept safe rather than like the uh, filming. We've done all the complicated stuff on the way there and um, got where we need to. We found the beginning of this side of the Viking Trail, which then those that watch the channel know that we've done that the other way, which was from sort of, um, uh, Whitstable way all the way around so we're going to plan to do Canterbury, Whitstable all the way around the Viking Trail and come back to Dover. Um, it's probably going to be a couple of day or one um, so um, yeah I hope you really enjoyed this video um, this day was absolutely stunning thank you to Colin who's up there my, my co-pilot for today and um, yeah we've had an awesome time hope you enjoy it. See you later guys. Bye.